So today we are at Glyn Hopkins Suzuki Buckhurst Hill and I'm here to show you our approved used car of the week. So we have a Suzuki Swift model here, a 67 plate. Uh, this particular model is the high spec SZ5. Uh, it comes in speedy blue and premium silver as you can see from the biotone colours here on the body and roof. Being the SZ5 model, uh, it has certain luxuries that lower spec models don't tend to have. Uh, this includes 16 inch diamond cut alloys and it also has adaptive LED headlights at the front of the vehicle uh, around here and you'll find it also has the same at the back. So before I take you into the front of the vehicle um, I want to show you the boot because it is packed full of space. Ideal for when you need to carry some luggage or uh, if you're trying to run errands and you just need to put things in the back here plenty of room to complete the task at hand. So the first thing you'll notice when we open the door here is that the Suzuki Swift is packed full of space. It's packed full of space at the front and not only the front, it's packed full of space at the back, leaving plenty of leg room for any passengers that you're taking on your journey. So the first thing you'll notice when you sit in the front of the vehicle is usually the steering wheel controls. So there's plenty of controls here and the reason for that is because there's lots of technology on board the Suzuki Swift. Uh, so on the left hand side this is where you control your radio, your Bluetooth, your music and so on. And then on the right hand side you'll have your cruise control controls. So what I'll do now is I will take you through the infotainment system of the vehicle just to give you a quick guide. So the home screen is divided into four quarters. The top left hand side is where you can control your radio and Bluetooth. Top right hand side is where you control your calls, look at your call log, add your mobile phone, uh, accept and reject calls and so on. Bottom left hand side is where you see your satellite navigation. So from here you can add in your address, uh, look for point of interest or even search for previous destinations which you've searched for before and then once your address is typed in you'll find that you have satellite navigation. And then the bottom right hand side is a simple smartphone link. This is for when you wish to connect your mobile phone to the car using USB. Uh, this is perfect for Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. So this vehicle has 32,407 miles on the clock at this point in time. And what I'll do now is show you the engine. To open the bonnet, you simply go down here and pull this lever. So to open the bonnet at the front end of the vehicle, all you have to do is put your finger in here and then slide to the left and you'll be able to lift up. So as you can see here, uh, the engine is very nice. We have a one litre booster jet, gives you plenty of performance and is as efficient on motorways as it is city roads. So that is our car of the week. If you're interested, feel free to get in touch with us here at Glyn Hopkin. Uh, you could always give us a call to chat through our finance options or you can browse our website and find it through Glyn Hopkin Suzuki. Uh, we hope to hear from you soon.